Good evening, folks. Good evening. As you can see, I'm in my Gundam right now. I had to make a full run. I just got back. Um, this video is going to be an outro to that uh, Spanish verbal boxing video I just released. So I'm just going to talk about some of the experiences that I had in that video as usual. So let's get right to it. Uh, oh, and by the way, for those of you who don't know, you know, today, what is it? Today, today's date is March 12th. March the 12th, my birthday, and I can't believe I am 32. The big 32 today. Ain't that something? Anyway, yeah, the video was, uh, the experience was good. I got some Spanish in. Um, the first place I went to, it was a little bit, I think I could have gotten more in, but I don't know, it was just something that kind of, I don't know, I don't know what it was, but. I think I could have gotten more Spanish in. Um, it was the, those two guys you saw me talk to. Well, actually, the three guys I spoke to, they couldn't speak English. Uh, they couldn't speak any English at all. And um, I, was trying, I was trying to ask them how to say song. I forgot to say it in Spanish. It's like Calinta or something like that. I can't remember. But um, that's what I was trying to ask them. But um, they weren't getting it. So um, the other guy I talked to, it was all right. I found that I was doing most of the talking and asking questions. And as you guys know, um, even in English, I'm not very talkative. And I don't really hold conversations that long. Um, when I have these conversations, these conversations with people, I'm basically um, adding on to what they say or, or just um, answering their questions in different ways. So it, I don't know, it feels a little awkward to me when I'm the only one doing all the talking and um, answering or asking all the questions. So, yeah, it was like I, I know what I wanted to talk about. I wanted to talk about that, you know, studying different languages, how, it, how it's enriching and whatnot. But I don't know. It was just so weird because the guy was so quiet. He wasn't really talking. He, it was just like, man, why don't you say something? I was like, why don't you say something? So. Yeah, it was it happened with him and then the guy who was working in the truck selling the tacos. Um, I like the Haitian place. That was totally unexpected. I, I had no idea that I was going to get Spanish in there. My whole intention of going there was to see if they spoke Creole because this is a language that I am looking forward to learning soon. I was just going to go in there. Um, I was going to order something. But I was going to just see if they spoke Creole language, see how long they've been open for and whatnot. And as you guys know, as you saw, the guys in there, one of the guys, he spoke Spanish. So I was able to get some Spanish in with him. Um, I'm so glad I took my camera because I started not to. It's like, you know what, I'm going to just go in here and see if they speak this Creole language. Almost left my camera, but then I said, you know what, I don't want to, it's better to be safe than sorry. So let me just take my camera with me. So, like I said, it was totally, 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 totally random. I had no idea that was going to happen. So, yeah, um, that's pretty much it. Oh, yeah, um, to kind of recap on this uh, verbal boxing. Originally, what I wanted to do was just choose one place to go to and just practice the, you know, Spanish or whatever language I choose and just focus on one topic or just having, like, a long conversation in general. But, um... I changed my mind because I noticed that when I go to certain places, people be busy and I, I'm not, I won't be able to like do that all the time. So what I decided to do was um, just go to different places, multiple places. So I'm, if it's Spanish, just go to all Spanish places. If it's Chinese, go to all Chinese places where they speak Chinese. So that's what I'm going to do for these verbal boxing videos. I'm just going to choose one language. And it's just going to be that language for the entire video. If it be an hour, hour 20 or whatever, it's just going to be that that language. So this video I made for Spanish was only like, it was less than an hour. Um, <clears throat> I just cut it short. I went this past weekend and um, I was going to go get some more Spanish in. Actually, I went to another taco place and um, it was a perfect place. I'm going to save it for next time. They didn't they didn't have they didn't accept credit cards. So I couldn't I couldn't sit there and I didn't have any cash to buy tacos. So that's going to be a place I save for the next time. But um, 
yeah, overall, it was fun as usual. I got some Spanish in, I got some EXPs. Because that, I mean, at the end of the day, that's what it's mainly about is getting the points. And I got the points and the experience. So, all right, that is it. I am about to go into the house now. It's getting late. And um, thanks for viewing. And uh, let me know if you guys have any questions. Oh, and the subtitles, I'm going to add those later on sometime. I wanted to get this video up at ASAP because I'm a bit late. And this video was supposed to be up at the beginning of the month. So I want to try to stay on time with these these uh, type of videos and these verbal boxing. The verbal boxing video is supposed to be at the beginning of the month. And in a normal level of video, it's supposed to be at the end. So, um, yeah. So that's that. And uh, I think I covered everything. And um, thanks for viewing. And uh, talk to you guys shortly.